Barbara Parsons from Battle Creek, Michigan. Hi, Ellen. I thought you would enjoy this sign. It says 15 best things about our pubic schools. <laughs> That is incredibly sad. <laughs> I'm guessing one of the 15 things isn't spelling. <laughs> oh, man. You know, the worst part is they used pubic tax dollars to pay for that, <laughs> which led to a large pubic outrage, <laughs> and someone was pubically humiliated. <laughs> Emma Browning from Coffs Harbor, Australia. Ellen, I stumbled across this photo of my brother and grandparents, and I had to send it to you. Seems fine. Let's, uh-oh. Wait, let's zoom in. That doesn't look so good. Uh-oh. That's not right. So that means Grandpa must have the cat in a the hat. They've switched. <laughs> Shay Fortune from Port Orange, Florida. Ellen, I saw this sign in a convenience store. The picture says it all. <laughs> Extra fresh sperm. That's great. Oh. <laughs> well, it's... <laughs> You want it to be extra fresh, don't you? <laughs> my question, my only concern is if you buy it, when you get in the checkout line, does it count as one item or 10 billion? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Joanne I. Canetti. Uh, from Montreal, Canada. Hi, Ellen. Just wanted to share a picture with you. Something is definitely wrong with it. Just keep looking and see if... Uh... There are four things in the picture. If you just look between the lady's legs right there, I think you'll see... time. It is why I don't wear skirts. <laughs> it can happen. Mandy Adams from Troy, New York. I just saw this sign at the supermarket. Ha, ha, ha. It says, porn and beans. <laughs> porn and beans. Good old porn and beans. Or as Tony calls it, lunch break. <laughs> oh!